technical get today. Flowers for my wife and my daughter, you know? All you guys out there, you guys should be doing this every day, just like me. You know, I don't want to mean to make you look bad, but it's tough to compete with me. You want to wrestle me, CJ? Since you got your, your mouth pieces? Are you, are you like you? My kids definitely uh, keep me busy. My when I, when I get home and try to relax, it's usually active recovery where I get to wrestle and mess around with them again. So it's a life though. I love, I, I love playing with them. I love, you know, roughhousing with them and it's, it's awesome. Hold it up. That's for you, Cassidy. Thank you, Coco. Oh my goodness. And then that's for mommy. Cassidy, uh, you can give it to me like this. How pretty. For Cassidy, here, you want to hold this one for me? Oh my gosh, no braces. So How's it feel? Your and teeth are so straight, that's crazy. I love you. Obviously I'm fighting in New York, Madison Square Garden, so tomorrow, no plane rides, no time changes, no elevation changes, just a simple car ride into the city. And uh, that's it, and then that's my, I'm posting out there for the week. My family comes and meets me on Friday, and uh, I get to have fun on Saturday. You see, we fit so easily in there. We might as well throw some other things in there with you. Okay. Yeah, I feel good here in the Times Square. It's a very nice place. I was the the train was good. Uh, I don't train hard, just for jet lag, just for sweat. Easy work. Yeah, we're gonna do a little bit of pad work tonight. He's gonna do his normal typical run, which is 40 minutes. We don't wanna change anything up. It's been working smoothly from this point on, and we just wanna keep it just like it is. <laughs> and his energy level is ridiculous right now. So with him dancing upstairs, we already know we are in the right mindset. We're having a good time, and that's what we wanna be. We don't wanna be too stressed out. We wanna have a little good time and make it normal. This guy don't, don't, don't teach me English, man. <laughs> they teach me his slang. Ebonics. No. Ebonics first is how you communicate in America. Slang. Right now we're heading to uh, MSG, Madison Square Garden, to watch the Nets versus the Knicks. Yeah, boys. And it'll give me a chance to get acquainted with the, uh, the arena itself, feel the atmosphere. That feels awkward. <laughs> Yeah. This is crazy. A guy like Brunson, I bet you he's never had this kind of attention before in this fight. I bet you he's never like been in this kind of spotlight. This is different. I'm walking over here. What you want? Were oh, you a wise guy? I, I feel like crying tears of joy. That... No, man, I'm good. I can't. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> Hell no, I don't want to be that guy. See, I'm big and black, but I can't play basketball. I can dunk, that's about it. Yeah, facts, facts, facts. You have to embrace it, be part of the atmosphere, but then, then I can see my, my mind change, my face change, and I'm just like, okay, I'm still, I'm still in here. I'm not like lost in the whole shit. At the end of the day, if I can't fight, if I can't win, this is all goes away, so I gotta come in here and dominate. Uh, I can't. He can't not escape. You're not but I can go with my kids. Your yeah. kids can go. And, yeah. and who do you want? Probably tomorrow to, during the day. Who, who's not, but who's, who's expendable in the sense that if they get hurt, it's okay? Well, all the guys will swoon. Well, yeah, so Rosendo's okay. Rosendo. Rosendo's <laughs> doing <laughs> nice thing. Hey, this guy changes since he was on Countdown yeah. Show. This guy no, changes. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, this guy changes. This guy changes. Is that you very yeah. famous now? No. Oh, this, this guy is, is famous, guys. No. I don't know what you mean. It's the guys that are satellite here, too. I mean, Tiago Bill will Oh! Bill. Hi, Look, welcome back. Got off the plane and walked right into the case. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you very popular guy. No. Famous Tiago. Tiago, out of there. When you fight a guy like Derek, I expect him to see a guy across from him that's a lot smaller than him. I think he's gonna come at me and try to take me out. You know, when you look at the matchup and you see the size difference, 
um, I could only imagine his thoughts. He's never seen anybody as small as me in the octagon, so it may get away from him in terms of what he can do to me. It's deceptive. You know, you kind of can get tricked by the visuals when you're in the octagon with me until we start to fight. <laughs> Come on, Rudy. Come on, dog. Hey. The beast is in trouble. I'm sorry. I'm just so loose. I feel good. I'm in shape. Whitney's beautiful voice moves me. <laughs> we miss you, Whitney. Have your attention, please, customer Dreamall. Please check the podium here at C40. I see the camera crew. Oh, no, I did grab one. Right. Are you trying to mess up the hair, dude? Well, you already messed up. Yeah, that's pretty fucked up. I grew up in Copperfield, so. I'm down the street. Yeah. Just come forward. Just come forward. Going to New York. Going up there to pick something up. Captain Chapong has informed me two hours, 56 minutes, take off to touchdown. Also, ladies and gentlemen, uh, at this time, we'd like to uh, recognize Derek Lewis, who is on board with us today. And we'd like to wish him luck on his fight at Madison Square Garden on Saturday night. Best of luck to you, Derek. Yeah. This is nice. This is not bad. Even when like Le I fight, like if I win this fight and then fight Lesnar, I'm still doing pitches with two belts. What's going on? I know. Welcome, welcome. Yeah. She's dying my hair. She's making me have black hair. <laughs> I feel young again. Can you add him? He does. He got that beard off, shiny. <laughs> Don't take the mirror away. Don't, Don't take, take it. Woo, woo, woo. Heavy weight. He said, "I'm gonna take my shirt off." Heavy weight. <laughs> yeah. Right, Zachary. It's good, though. I'm sorry, Zachary. If I knew you were coming. Hey, 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 yes, you're going down. Good, good, good. How are we doing, buddy? Good, good. Everything good. Good to see you, buddy. 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 Good yeah. <laughs> Good luck. Hey, congrats, man. Good luck. 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 So I just got here today, just getting settled, stretching out a little bit. Last week up until, you know, the fight is just kind of staying sharp. Moving around, keeping our flow going. I think he's a solid striker, you know. Um, very rangy. I see a lot of holes in his game, but he's, he's good at what he do. He's good. He's a solid striker, you know. I've knocked some of the best strikers out in the UFC history and the division currently, so I can knock guys out. But it's all to me about you know sticking to my strength. Cut it. I'm an entertainer by nature. I've always been that way. I'm just about freestyle, the way I move, the way I carry myself, and I think because of my Nigerian heritage as well. We're not very uh, shy on letting you know who we are, what we're about. My first fight, it just reminded me of um, dancing because I was, uh, whatever I did, I was making the crowd react in Madison Square Garden. I mean, I was there last night. A guy like Ali has danced under those lights many times, you know, so now we can carry on the, uh, the tradition, the future of combat sports. Boom. Boom, shakalaka, boom. Somebody can be over there. Easy. Under light work. 